for today's creature feature. I'd like to begin this video by wishing you all a happy Halloween. Today is October the 30th as I'm recording this video. Tomorrow will be Halloween. You're watching this on October 31st. Today, October 30th, I will be celebrating in the city of Tampa what is known as Dr. Paul Bearer Day. TOG TV's master of ceremony since 1973, and whereas Dr. Paul Barra has hosted over 1,000 horrible old movies which have terrorized three generations, and whereas Dr. Paul Barra is the longest running horror movie host in the United States, and whereas Dr. Paul Barra's 20th anniversary celebration will be held at Bush Gardens on Saturday, October the 30th, 1930, 1993, you are old. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now, therefore, Sandra Friedman, by, the, by virtue of the authority vested in her as mayor of the city of Tampa, do hereby proclaim October the 30th, 1993, as Dr. Paul Barra Day in the city of Tampa, and urge all citizens to join me in congratulating Dr. Paul Barra. Well, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And thank you. And you're the only recipient to get two proclamations. Wow. <laughs> thank you very much. Paul. Appreciate it. You have been a contributor. Thank you. Thank you. Hope you More ways than one. Oh, yeah, really. And I hope you never let me down. No, I won't. As a matter of fact, I was thinking about running in politics myself when this is all over. And? Well, I'd champion all the dead issues. Of course, I'd have to be a frightened candidate, you know. <laughs> Dr. Paul Bearer was the master of ceremonies, the show, Creature Feature. I bet you've always wondered where I got that term from, that phrase, Creature Feature. It was from the show. Hey, could be somebody rent the room now. <laughs> Let me check the door, I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, well, there we go. Darn thing was about to stick on me. Well, hello. Well, good e afternoon. Come in, whoever yes. you are. <laughs> are you Dr. Paul Bear? Yes. 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 Uh, do you? Who are, who are you? Oh, forgive me. Permit me to introduce myself. My name is Fang Sinatra. Fang Sinatra? Yes, but you can call me Blue Eyes. Blue Eyes. Yes. You ran, you ran the ad in the, in the Transylvania Times. Yes, yes. About, the, about the tomb for rent. Oh, I see. The upstairs room. It's an upstairs room you have. Yes, you don't have anything, perhaps, uh, a little lower down. Like what? Like uh, the basement. The basement? Or maybe even... You mean you want to live in the basement? Yeah, the lower the better, you know. 30 years ago today, at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay, Dr. Paul Bearer was at Bush Gardens, and they filmed a live 20th anniversary creature feature show. Welcome to Dr. Paul Bearer's 20th anniversary special. Starring who else? Dr. Paul Bearer with goblins of fun and laughter. <laughs> and here he is, live from Bush Gardens, your master of ceremonies, Dr. Paul Bearer. Well, we certainly want to thank Mayor Sandy Freeman for declaring today Dr. Paul Bearer Day here in uh, the Tampa St. Petersburg area. And we're coming to you live, about as live as we get from uh, Bush Gardens. In fact, we're right in the middle of the Kumba roller coaster, which when translated, Kumba means beast. We have quite a few little monsters out here riding the Kumba roller coaster today. But getting back to Mayor Sandy Friedman, we certainly want to thank her for making this Dr. Paul Barrow Day. And I was talking to her last week, and I said, Sandy, you really ought to let your fingernails grow between now and Christmas time, because then during the Gould Tide season, they can call you Sandy Claus. <laughs> Very little humor there, but anyway, moving right along. Uh, today, this is gonna be a retrospect of uh, some of the stuff we've done over the past 20 years. We're celebrating our 20th anniversary on Creature Feature, and uh, we managed to save some of the older bits going back to the early 70s and mid 70s, and that's what you're gonna be seeing for the first 30 minutes here before the regular Creature Feature show. And during this retrospect, right up front, I'd certainly like to thank everyone who has watched Creature Feature over the years and made it possible for Dr. Paul Barra to still be in the Tenement Castle 20 years later. And I'm uh, very grateful for that. With your help, we'll just keep right on being in the Tenement Castle. Tell you what, let's take a minute out here for uh, 
and pay the rent and we'll be right back and get things started, okay? Dr. Paul Barra is a legend around these parts as far as horror. And if you're watching this and you remember that show, Creature Feature, I hope you enjoy this presentation. Tonight, we're heading to Bush Gardens and then Hallow Scream. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if it's your first time. I am Tampa Jay. And this is my hometown theme park, Bush Gardens, Tampa Bay. And I am proud to present to you this video. I'm going to go to the spot where they filmed that special, which you just watched, the 20th anniversary of Creature Feature, which would have been 30 years ago today. We're gonna go see where Dr. Paul Bear was standing on that presentation. Gardens, and we're right in the middle of the Kumba roller coaster. Kumba means beast in Swahili. Uh, I think in English it means I wish I hadn't eaten that barf burger. <laughs> and how about this for a creature to feature? The Bush Gardens alligators always have to say hello. To find the location of the 20th anniversary special of Dr. Paul Berry, you have to come all the way to the back to the Congo River Rapids Bridge just before the roller coaster Kumba. But uh, it is a thrilling ride. Last three minutes, believe it or not. That's the longest, fastest metal roller coaster in the southeastern United States. And right here in this spot on this bridge, where 30 years ago today, Dr. Paul Barrow was standing live on TV broadcasting the 20th anniversary special of Creature Feature. I'll put a picture right down there to the right hand corner. You can specifically see these pieces of wood cross behind him and Kumba out there in the background. He was standing right here. Dr. Paul Bear's real name was Dick Binnick. Well anyway, let's get back to what we're doing. About 30 minutes of <coughs> uh, retrospect, don't worry. It's not the cough that carries you off, it's the coughing that carries you off in that you got to worry about. Anyway, getting back to what we're doing now is a retrospect of some of the bits we've done over the years uh, with Dr. Paul Barra on uh, Creature Feature. We've had a lot of guests on the show, we've had uh, uh, a lot of products we've uh, fooled around with, we've been up in the music room decomposing some music. Somebody told me if we really started this retrospect, I'd really be opening a can of worms. <coughs> well, what the heck. Let's open the worms and get started. Pretty good looking worm too. So while I enjoy my worm, you enjoy the first part of some of the past. <laughs> good. If you grew up in the Tampa Bay area, if you grew up in Florida, odds are you remember Dr. Paul Barra and Creature Feature. I did not have the privilege to grow up in Florida. I didn't move here until I was 17, and that would have been 2004. But being a fan of horror, and living vicariously through many different things on YouTube, I naturally found Dr. Paul Bear and Creature Feature, and I wish I would have been around when that thing was going down. Thankfully, because of the internet and because of friends, I have relived uh, his works and have been a fan of Dr. Paul Bear since the first time I watched an episode of Creature Feature on YouTube. And if you want to watch Creature Feature, make sure you check it out. Just Google Creature Feature or YouTube it. It is out there, the program, which I just showed you, the 20th anniversary special, which was filmed right up there, is on YouTube, and that's how I learned about it. A couple months ago, I found that special, and it all clicked. Hallow Scream, Bush Gardens, Halloween's Eve, October 30th, 30 years later, Dr. Paul Bearer, and it all clicked, and I was like, you know what? I have to go talk about this, and I have to celebrate Dr. Paul Bearer Day with everyone especially the fans out there. And also, I just wanted to, uh, I wanted to make known of his uh, legendary career and the life of Dr. Uh, of Dick uh, Benick, because not a lot of people may know who Dr. Paul Bearer was. You remember the Paul Bearer, the Undertaker's uh, friend, Paul Bearer? Well, where do you think he got his name from? WWF Paul Bearer. Hmm, yep. Give credit where credit is due for today's Creature Feature, just as I say. And also, Dr. Paul Bearer, the Master of Ceremonies, held the pun as the highest form of humor. If you've seen Creature Feature, he is full of puns. And that is one reason why I really enjoy it. I have always rocked 
a good pun here on this channel. And I do want to give credit where credit is due. Thank you, Dr. Paul Bear, for such an awesome career and for an awesome show. I wish he could be here today to celebrate the 30th anniversary of that uh, program. And if he were alive today, it would be the 50th year of Creature Feature. Wow. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this uh, this tribute to Dr. Paul Bear, especially if you grew up with him. Um, I envy you guys. I wish I was alive. I did have a horror host growing up. Sammy Terry was the horror host uh, for Indiana. Also, Sven Gulli, uh, who knows the legend, Me TV Sven Gulli. I still like to watch that uh, on Saturday nights when I catch it. So I'm a really big fan of horror and the horror hosts, and that's naturally how I found Creature Feature. And uh, also, a shout out to my good friend, Mark Muncie of eerietravels.com. He's the one that showed me where Dr. Paul Bear lived over in St. Petersburg. Here comes the this being the Saturday before Mummy's Day, Mummy's Day being tomorrow. Uh, my mummy is supposed to come by and visit me this afternoon. That must be her now. <laughs> oh, I haven't seen her in a long time, I'll tell you that. Come in, come in, mummy. <laughs> hey, Buck, how's this for an unusual name? Yeah. Dr. Paul Barra of WTOG, St. Petersburg, Florida. You know, Roy, that's not really unusual, because everybody's heard of St. Petersburg, Florida. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Paul Barra, did you know that Archie Campbell smokes quarter cigars? Yeah, I know. Somebody's already smoked the other three quarters. <laughs> Tonight, I'm out here at Hollow Scream for my third time this season. I purchased a ticket to Hallow Scream tonight. I'm going to walk through a couple haunted houses for Dr. Paul Bear in his name. And we're going to celebrate with a creature feature. How about that? Shout out to Bush Gardens uh, for always being so good to me. I really love this theme park. I love Hallow Scream. I've been coming since I was in high school when I moved here. Uh, 2004 was the first time I came out here. And uh, back when they filmed... Uh, that episode right up there on that bridge. I don't think Hallow Scream was a thing, but I've been coming since 2004 and I really love this event and I've done a lot of haunted houses uh, around America this season, walked through some pretty epic ones and I thought it would be cool for the last haunt of the year to come back to my favorite Scream Park, Hallow Scream Bush Gardens and it, it just all came together. Hallow Scream, Dr. Paul Bearer Day, um, October 30th, it just all made sense. So. I wanted to come out here today and celebrate and make a video in tribute to the master of scaremonies. 22 years, that's a long time for a television show and a long time to host Creature Feature. So check it out. I will post a link to the uh, special, the 20th anniversary special uh, that I played in the beginning of the video and also I'll, I'll show a couple of other videos. But for now, I'm gonna wait for the sun to go down for Bush Gardens to close and how the scream to open up and we're going to walk through some haunted houses in the name of Paul. Also, I think I might write Kumba. Why not? That thing is 30 years old. I believe it opened in 92 or 93. Part of the reason Paul was standing in front of it was because Bush Gardens was trying to promote their new roller coaster. And now that the bridge is clear, this is the spot right here to the left. Dick Benick, 30 years ago today. Hasn't changed much. Hasn't changed at all. Kumba, Kumba, Kumba. Ain't no row like the front row. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Oh yeah! Woo -hoo -hoo! Yeah! Oh man, this is too slow. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, that was good. Oh, wow. Woo. 
All right, guys, I actually have to go to the front of the park because Bush Gardens is about to close and Hallow Scream is about to open up. And I cannot not come to Bush Gardens and not say hello to my flamingos. Oh my gosh, they're so close to the fence. Hello, I missed you. I missed you so much. All oh, y'all look so beautiful. If you take a screenshot, it'll last longer. Also, hashtag Tampa J, please. Share that. And this will be the second to last night for Bush Gardens Hallow Scream. This night before Halloween. Halloween is their last night. Merchandise, 30% off. And while I wait for Hallow Scream to open up, I'm doing a bit of spooky shopping. I sent a picture to Chris the Girl, and she said she loved this cauldron mug. So I'm going to pick that up and also. If you remember the tree from the beginning of the video in our house, the spooky Halloween tree decorated by my fiance Chris, Chris the girl, this would be awesome. An ornament, a crystal ball hollow scream ornament. I'm gonna grab this as well. And this is my third time here this season. I came for the media preview and then I did a full walkthrough on the second week for Hallow Scream way back in September. That feels like a long time ago. It was a long time ago. I've been to so many places, so many states since I was last back here at Hallow Scream for 2023. Tonight, not gonna do the full walkthrough. I've already done that. I'm just gonna go to a couple of haunted houses. I'm gonna go to some of my favorite ones. So I hope you enjoy it. All in the name of Dr. Paul Barrett. And I will be walking through Stranglewood Estates. One of my favorite houses this year. Really like this one. Very gothic, very dark, very creepy. Oh, doors have opened. Someone's coming out. been welcome. On is on. Yes. I don't know. I got a bad feeling about this. And I am first. Here we go. On is on. Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, hello. This is awesome. First one in. For today's creature feature, we walk through for Dr. Paul. Bearer. Love it. Oh! Oh, that got me. Woo! Happy Halloween. Loving this. It's one of my favorite ones. Clock. I'm just gonna let the camera roll. It's gonna be. Oh! Oh man, that was so good. You got me. gonna let it roll tonight. Happy Halloween everyone. I wish I could bring my light. Whoa. Oh that was great. Someone had the beans. Someone had the whoa! Someone over there. The sets in here are awesome. That way. That way. So good. So spooky. Man, he didn't make it, did he? Oh. <laughs> spooky win. Whoa, whoa, double tap. Got me from the other side. Whoa, oh, thirds. <laughs> into another room. Here we go. Looks like we're going into the basement or the boiler room. Yes, the boiler room. Oh, no. Oh, it smells like chicken. No, it smells even worse than that. Freddy Krueger in there? Maybe burn them all. Whoa! Oh, Whoa! Help me, please, Paul! Oh. Oh, please help me, burn! Oh. So good. Oh. So good. Woo! Making our way. The back side of the boiler room. Oh, there's someone in there. Hello. Making our way now. Toilet! Oh no! Oh, that got me. I was looking at oh, the toilet squirting me. Oh, I love this good old toilet trick. Oh, tastes like Clorox. Woo! Whoa, spooky room. Oh, that was good. Whoa! Whoa! Oh man! 
Dude, that was so good. All right, we're in the attic, I think. All right, who's real? Who's not real? Who's real? Who's not real? Whoa! <laughs> Look at that. So creepy. All right. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Oh, someone behind me in the dark. Oh, it's so dark in here. I can't see where to go. Okay, I found it. I found it. Nice little curtain. Okay, all right, I crawled last time. Might as well crawl this time, right? Are you sure? Yeah, I think so. Much below. Watch your head, she'll take it. Much ahead, they say. Uh, all right. <laughs> I'm trying. Oh, it's hard when you wet your wrist. Oh. Okay, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. Oh, <laughs> Woo. oh my gosh. Out of the screen, baby. All right, we're in the green oh. house. Oh, I was just said we were in the greenhouse. Thank you. My ticker. My ticker. So cool. Woo! All right. Whoa. All right. Now we're in the garden, I think. Oh. Oh. The plants come alive just like Frampton did. Oh. Love it. Love it. So spooky. Stay right there. Don't move. Stay right there. Don't move. Who's real? So creepy. So cool. Whoa. I hear something. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> oh, that was a good one. All right, I think we're almost out. I think we're almost out. Oh, that thing moves. That thing moves. Look at that. Okay, here we go. I think this is it. We made it. Woo! And the sun is still going down, just like Iron Gwazi in the distance. Yeah, haunt is still on. Okay, my favorite scare zone of the year, right around the corner, much ahead. Bright light, big city, come and set my zombie on fire. Welcome to Las Vegas. Oh, there's the king. Look at that, the dead king. I love this scare zone, my favorite of the year. Hello, king, good to see you again. Yes, I like it. I like it very much. Oh my gosh, that looks like it hurt. Oh, oh, oh that's so good. Ah, zombie! Zombie, help me, this one really likes me. Oh, oh no, whose face is that? Oh, he looks familiar. He looks very familiar. I like your bell. So good. Love the Route 66, Las Vegas theme. These are the same scare actors I saw earlier in the season too. Looks like I found the office. Whoa! Oh, I remember you. It's the chef. Yeah, bon appetit. Bone appetit. Yes. So good, so good. Oh, I love this scare zone. One of the best of the year. Hello. Whoa! The best of the year. Oh, get him! Get him! Get him, chef! Get him! Tastes like chicken, right? Tastes like chicken. Ah, now you want me! Ah, ah, help me! Help! Zombie! Ah, I don't remember this phone booth. Alright. We're gonna call collect. Yes, Tampa Police Department. This is Tampa J over at Bush Gardens. Send all cars. There are zombies everywhere. <laughs> oh. Looks like a good drink. I bet it's to die for, isn't it? Delicious. I'm really gonna miss this scare zone. I hope we see it return next year. Please keep this one, Bush Gardens. Oh! Please keep it. Hey, hey, you, come here. Me? No, not you. Oh. The other one. Oh, there's... Come here, go talk to him. Who? Hey, there's no one here. this lady. What? Oh, yeah. I think we should cast her as Lady Godiva. Oh, It'll be okay. okay, except I think the horse would steal the show. <laughs> talk about Dr. Paul Baraday. That's a great one. <clears throat> what is wrong with you? Who, Sorry. me? You know, if you were twice as smart, you'd still be stupid. Oh, yeah? Well, if you were twice as stupid, you'd still be... Never mind. <laughs> hey, look at that guy. 
Which guy? The one over there. Me. The one over there. You know, the one with his head up is, uh, yeah, that one. Oh, yeah. I get that a lot. Yeah, he, he looks scared. A little bit. Hey, I'm going to scare him. Okay, go ahead. Boo. Ah! That's pretty pathetic. Yeah, that, that wasn't too scary. But, you know, he doesn't look that bright anyway. Oh, thanks. Oh, why you say that? Well, he's the guy who took a ruler to bed to find out how long he slept. True story. Ho, 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 ho. Now, I know some of you have already put up your Christmas tree. So why don't we do Home for the Holidays, the residents. I love this one. Haunt is on. Christmas is on. Look at that. It's a PT Cruiser Bruiser. Is that Clark W. Griswold driving in there? No. Kind of looked like him though. He's a little more hair. All right, here we go. Merry Christmas, everyone. Happy Halloween. A little nightmare before Christmas. Just gonna let the camera roll. Love this haunt. Oh, I see what you're doing there, penguin. They got two penguins here. Oh no, she didn't make it. Oh. <laughs> oh, hello. You better not cry. You better. Oh, something over there. All right, I think I found the living room in the tree. Oh, it's the kitchen. Hello. Ah, that looks delicious. Oh, Merry Christmas. That got me. <laughs> All right, next room. Oh, a little chimney. Looks like they're roasting uh, chest nuts. <laughs> Shout out to Paul Bear. Oh, there's someone right there. Whoa, oh my gosh. Why do they have to get Uncle Pat? Whoa, bedroom, whoa! That scared me, bedroom. Whoa, whoa! Oh no, they still haven't cleaned the sink. They still haven't cleaned it. They haven't cleaned the toilet either. Whoa! Oh, hello, oh! Peekaboo, I see you. Helps everywhere. Oh, little kids! Ah. <laughs> All right, making our way here. Oh, hey, I like that. It's snowing in Florida. It's snowing in Florida. That wasn't a friend. All right, let's see if Santa's here. Oh, it's jolly old Saint Nick. Check this out. Hello, Santa. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. Good to see you. Good to see you. <laughs> Oh, Merry Christmas. Hello. Hi. Is this your cave? I like it. Yeah. Whoa. Into the cave of Christmas. So spooky. Looks like I may have found the attic. Whoa, there's a little... Oh, watch out for the rat. All right. Whoa, whoa. Watch whoa. out. Whoa. All right, we're outside. I think we made it. I think we made it. All right, hey, gotta pick, oh, gotta pick out a Christmas tree. How about that one? Whoa. I hear something. Whoa. Whoa. You gotta, oh, you gotta have a saw to go down the tree. For tonight's creature feature, everyone, I present to you inside the Dragon Fire Grill, the rolling boat. looking at me. <laughs> that is terrifying. <laughs> it's okay to leave for like, I mean. It takes one to know one. It's always the drummers. Yeah, always the drummers. Always the drummers. That one did a killer job. <laughs> you killed it, no pun intended. 
No. Literally killed him. He's still there, isn't he? He's, still there. he's he's right behind me. I think I'm just gonna back away slowly. Back away slowly. Happy Halloween, my friend. Happy Halloween. Let's see how long this goes. All right, I'm getting out of here. I came to pick up my goods inside my locker. Eight, one, two, eight. All right, so this looks a whole lot better at night. Check that out. So good. That's the latest I've ever been to Hollow Scream. Been coming here since 2004. Never been on the eve of Halloween or Halloween itself. Maybe one year. For today's creature feature, we conclude in the parking lot. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope you all are having a happy and safe Halloween out there. Today is Halloween, releasing this video on October 31st. I really appreciate you guys hanging with me this season. We started way back. We started Halloween way back and it's not over. I'm gonna film my Halloween experience tomorrow. So November 1st, tomorrow that will drop. So I look forward to seeing you all there. If you enjoyed this video, if you are a fan of Creature Feature, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was an honor to come out here and to reminisce about Dr. Paul Bearer on his day. Um, yeah, I look forward to coming out here again. It was cool to be out here for the 30th anniversary. And I got word that Dr. Paul Bearer's hearse is here at Bush Gardens and I've actually got it in the video several times. Actually, 2018 when I was out here, I started my video in front of a hearse. That is actually creature feature Dr. Paul Bearer's hearse and it's still here at Bush Gardens. They didn't set it out this year, but I, I got uh, word that they're they're trying to set it out again next year. It's It's been sitting out here for a while and uh, I, uh, I hope they bring it out and they, you know, shine it up or whatever and uh, we can we can pay tribute to Dr. Paul Bear with the hearse. That's pretty incredible. That was on the show and there's several photos of Dr. Paul Bear driving that hearse around Tampa Bay. So it's pretty cool that they have a unique piece of history right here at Bush Gardens. Again, 30 years ago today, mark the day for Dr. Paul Bear and I'm glad that we could come back and relive it. And thank you for watching guys. Know you're awesome, know you're loved, and no matter who you are, what you're going through, just know there's always much ahead and always Halloween and horror here on this channel. Oh yeah, love Montu. One of my favorites right there. Used to ride that thing, in, uh, you know, in high school and college when I went to USF, I, uh, I used to stop over here on my break and ride Montu. Just a fun fact there for you. I've been coming here a long time, so had to come out here for Halloween's Eve for so many reasons. All right, I'm gonna end it. Gotta go home, edit this video, put it together, and happy Halloween. That's it. Oh, of course. I'm sorry. You had to celebrate Dr. Paul Baraday from the car, Wedge. My bad. I'll take you next time. She was a fan of Creature Feature as well. All right, everyone. The witch wants to say, Happy Halloween. Enjoy that candy. See you tomorrow. So you can watch me eat mine. I might carve a pumpkin or two. We'll see. I'm going to do something. Do something special. All right. You can come too. I won't forget you. I promise. Man. She loves attention. Good night. Watch ahead. See you tomorrow.